I don't know what it is. Sunday streams are just so relaxing and chill for me. I absolutely love it. All right, so in the match, I need to start hit confirming into this. Because if I hit confirm into this in the corner, even if I'm not close enough to get this, I'm still getting better damage than just doing this. And I'm starting to use my meter better. So meter management is something, or even resources, using resources, not management. Just reusing resources is something that I need to start prioritizing. Because a lot of the time, that's my hit confirm. It's this if they block, or it's this if I hit. I don't want to do that anymore. I want to start trying to get into my muscle memory that it's this if they hit, this if they block, or even sometimes if I notice I keep blocking and stuff like that, trying to go and stop to go into this. I mean, even trying to do this might be an idea because this still leaves me at a good space to go boom, boom, and then try and poke them back to get them into a decent realm for me to start trying to poke them with a fireball and stuff like that. I know this is minus one on block, but still. And I think this is minus two on, I mean, plus two on block. I could be wrong. So yeah, if they throw out a, like a poke because they notice that I'm doing that quite well, like quite often, I can suffer from that. But at the same time, it's something that I should be trying to throw out every now and then to actually dissuade them moving back forwards and stuff like that. Or just holding back. Try to just learn what people's options are, what reuse options are, if I'm not getting, like if they, I'm just getting blocked. Like I need to figure out ways to open up people more. And doing two hits with this, not great because it pushes me that back that far and I have to walk in again. Maybe I should start trying to use this. Because this is what, this is plus three on hit. So counter hit adds two frames, which means it's going to be plus five. So if I time this correctly, I should be able to get a counter hit confirmed from that. If not, I can also switch up the offense with this because the pushback isn't too great. And if I can get it with this, it'd be even better. So I can still do it from that to that. Just little things that I need to start thinking about. And if you're learning these type of games as well, along with me, something that you should probably think about as well. Come on. Let's turn up okay. Ken, I didn't catch your name. You know what else I've been forgetting to do? I've been forgetting to switch this the camera. The ha. <laughs> I hope it was on the thing. Matt 333. Like a laundry mat? Or what are we doing? Whoops, that was too early. Hmm, I wonder if I could DP that. I kind of want to see what this guy's doing. It's just giving me B meter at the moment, which is kind of good. But, um... I did a freaking cross cut that didn't come out because I oh no DP. What's it? Why did I jump? That was a bad bad thing to do. Oh no DP. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, this stage definitely does have lag, and I don't know if that's a myth or. But every time we play on stages like this, I'm noticing that we're getting that stuttering. You know what I mean? And again. I haven't really checked, but it could be. Ah, dude, I tried to do a DP there. I wasn't ready for it. I could be my connection, but yeah, I'm not sure yet. I need to actually do some investigation of that. That lag ate my medium kick. Okay, I can't reach once the Hadouken's gone. Good to know. Okay, he's got me there. Actually, I didn't buffer a DP. I need to check if that works. So in the, like, if I can get that first frame of invincibility. Hang on. Okay. Wake up DP. We'll wake up something. Okay, I really, I, I felt it in my bones, but I was like, I'm wrong. I'm always wrong about that. So it's good to see my intuition's getting a look. And I didn't buffer the DP. Oh no. Connection's not great, guys. It's eaten a lot of my inputs, I'm finding. Either that, or I'm just bad at inputs today. No, no DP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I definitely missed that there. Good game, man. Good game, Matt. Uh, I'll give you a rematch anyway. It's just good practice. you got a lot of those habits that I need to actually uh, learn to beat. No diss against you, bro. We all learn things differently. I just need to learn how to fight that. Oh, bro, you're super silver, too. Man, so many good players on today. <laughs> Jump. There we go. Okay, this guy likes to hit buttons when he wakes up. Mm. 
I don't think I would have reached from there if I had to try to DP. Dude, what am I doing? I freaking not buffering. I oh, know. I tried to grab that fireball. I'm so glad that I mistimed that and it blocked before the actual thing happened. Oh no, DP. I don't know if it's this lag or I'm actually stressing again with the. Uh... Oops. Hmm. Oop. Oh. Okay, you definitely got me there. I hit that tech way too early and it was on the first one. <laughs> I can't believe that Tatsu freaking change of trajectory actually works. Oh, dude, I thought there was an EX Tatsu cover. Not Tatsu, uh... What is it called? Oh, no DP! Congrats, man. I need to see, actually. Oh, dude, wait. Yeah, exactly. I could freaking do the buffer off of the parry and I could have got it that. Ah, oh, man, I need to start trying to do this stuff. Hmm. Okay. Learning new things. I ran into that punch. Oh, dude, that was meant to be a freaking uh, crosscut and it didn't come out. Oh, that was meant to be a DP too. I feel like there's an EX Tatsu. Not Tatsu, DP. Why do I keep getting that mixed up? To Dude, he was already in the air! <laughs> Dude, I was waiting for it. I was like, maybe I can jump over his uh, EX DP. And this guy likes to freaking throw fireballs for Ken a lot, eh? Oh, shite. Oh, no DP. Nice, 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 nice. Thank you for the games, Matt. Might be that stage, buddy, or your connection. Maybe we're just far away, but I'll give you the benefit of the doubt and say it's a stage. Thank you so much for the matches, mate. Uh, a couple things that I can think off the top of my head that I need to fix in that matchup that I was doing wrong. Uh, let's think. I need to start using the buffering thing that I was talking about. So buffering in the actual inputs before the recovery of the other move finishes. So that I can actually try to see what the actual timing is on fireballs and spacing and stuff like that is. Because at the moment, I think... I've only been able to get a very small fraction of people who actually f jump over my fireball because I was waiting before until they were already in the air before I started doing this, like the actual motion. So it's adding probably another half a second onto my reaction of someone actually in the air. It's a problem. Doesn't sound like a lot, but in fighting games, it's a lot. So the difference would be, and then I see them and I do this. And now this, all I have to do is just actually tap that punch button. I might need to time it a little bit better. I wonder how late we can delay that. No. You know what actually might work as well? Is if someone actually delays, if I do that DP motion, just rocking back into the uh, down to diagonal forward to get the shortcut for the DP. This opens up so many things, man. I know this seems like such a stupid little simplistic thing, but it means a lot, right? And it's something that I just didn't think about before. Because I thought, again, I was manually timing things before. But all these little things culminate, culminate, I can speak English today, into bigger things. Super Saiyan Gilgamesh. It's a good name. <laughs> As a fellow aficionado of uh, Dragon Ball Z myself. <laughs> aficionado? I don't think that's the right word. Connoisseur is the word I'm looking for. Oh, God. <laughs> Not on you, that was on me, man. I, I don't know what I was doing. I didn't uh, realize if I could DP then or... Ooh, that, I don't know if that actually worked or he just wasn't holding block after that. Ooh, unfortunate. Can I actually get a good combo here? Oh, dude, that was the wrong one. Ah, dude, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. Hang on. Oh, dude. <laughs> I thought it was a medium kick coming. <laughs> Okay, hang on. Jump, gonna jump. Ooh, there's that medium kick. Okay, this guy's not hitting a lot of buttons and I just need to stop trying to outplay this guy because I'm not good enough. I wasn't pumping that uh, DP. Buffing, not pumping. Pumping sounds bad. Ooh, ooh, cross me up too, good job. Come back in the sentry. Good shit, good shit. Kick my ass. <laughs> a lot of mistakes there. A lot of mistakes there. Good to see. I. <laughs> What am I doing, man? 
Oh, the punishment. Yeah, that was meant to be a cross. That was should have been a cross cut, and I went for the actual normal DP. Hmm? Going for the grab. No, wait. Kemi can't do a tech throw unless it's a light kick, correct? Hmm. I was a little slow on that button. And I'm kind of watching this guy now play his own game. And I really shouldn't do that. So especially against Kami. Dude, he would have caught me then too. If I... Oh no! I'm not doing the freaking buffer! Nice. I tried to do a DP. All good. Good comeback, Gilgamesh. Man, good job. Good adjustment. Maybe he just jumped on as well. He's just like, ah, oh, I gotta get the rust off. I don't think we've... I think we've won one match today. <laughs> it's usually how it is. Usually, when I'm on stream, we start to go down. If I have a couple of matches off stream, I end up with a win streak. As I said, I think it's that whole thing of doing multiple things at once. You know, males, we're not exactly the greatest multitaskers in the first place. And I have a goldfish brain. So, you know, that also doesn't help. Ooh, poke. Okay, what can I get off this? All right, cool, 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 cool. I'm starting to try and think about like what I can get off of stun combos because I am not exactly the greatest of that. And that was such a read, it wasn't funny. Oh God, that was, I tried to do it again. I talked myself up, got in my own head. Ooh, nice me. And I'm sitting there watching. Good shit, Gilgamesh. Yep, come on, what you got, what you got, what you got. Dude, you probably could have killed me if you had it on the EX there. Um, I'm not sure. Again, I don't play Kami, so... Oh god, that was terrible. Dashboard. I knew it. Ah, I thought you were going to go and sit there and hold down back, but why would you? I've got low health, you don't. See, that's the thing I start to need to start thinking about. Oh god, <laughs> I didn't even realize the cat. Well, I did, I just didn't remember that option. Uh, what do we got? There we go. Oh, dude! Nice dash in on the recovery of that freaking medium kick. I myself have not... That was a weird interaction. I myself have not figured out how to do that properly yet. But I should have done Tatsu off that. That was a nice EX to catch my... freaking jump in, but you know? Oh, dude, I'm, I'm ducking, I'm ducking, I'm ducking. That was terrible. Ooh, nice damage. Oh, she's plus there. Hmm. Dude, I swear to god I hit tech there. I must have not hit the buttons properly. Maybe a little too late. I was on the side of the buttons, so maybe I didn't hit them actually properly. Thank you so much for those games. They were really fun. And again, I think I forgot to change my camera. <laughs> I did. No, I didn't. Okay, I was on that side. I'm actually hitting anti-airs though, which is good. Holy crap, guys. I legitimately did not expect to do that. As I said, I haven't really been paying much this week, so... Paying? Playing? Eh. I haven't been playing much this week. I've only been doing my training sessions that I do every day. And a lot of them have not been anywhere or anything to do with uh, anti-air training. A lot of my training that I have been doing has been actually with Ken right here. I've been training how to punish this thing. So I'm trying to actually get the timing on this because this is minus four as you can see right there. I've been trying to see if I can, and I'm not even getting it today. Again, I only really started this this week and I'm still not like proficient at it. And I effed up that DP input. Yeah, see? So, doing this type of stuff is a lot more difficult than one would think, right? So this is the type of stuff that I've had suggested to me to practice. Because if I can't do it here, I'm definitely not going to be able to do it in the match. Like, I can do... Wow, I was going to say I can do this one easy enough, but I cannot actually. Let me see if I can get the timing on this. Yeah. So I can get the timing on that one. I'm literally trying to get it off the jab into a light kick at the moment because, yeah, I'm screwing up the timing, I find, on this. So let's try and get this first thing up. Ooh, maybe a little bit early. There we go. So from there, no, that was meant to be a DP. Okay, I'm not hitting it down on that. But again, this type of stuff also helps me with that DP input and under stress. So I think honestly, because I've been doing it on there and I am getting that after like an initial effing it up for about maybe three minutes, maybe four, 
I start to get that DP input a bit more consistently. I'm thinking because there's a lot of stress there, because I'm like, oh, but like a really tight, like a small amount of time. I'm starting to actually get better at doing that DP under stress, which is what was missing from my play before. Well, my practice, I should say, not my play. Reginald, let's go. Oh no, I was asleep at the wheel. Okay, he's backing up. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Can I punish that? No, I can't. Okay, I don't know if that was a whiff punish. I'm trying to test this guy at the moment to see what he can actually do. And I can't deep. <laughs> okay, it wasn't my turn though. I tried to get freaking counter that. Not counter parry is the right word. Can this guy, okay, that was misspaced. Actually, that is a very common thing that I'm finding a lot of people will do with Ryu. They will uh, use forward heavy punch and they will parry directly after it because it is minus two. And I'm not sure how quickly pa Ryu's parry comes out. It might be a three framer, but they're getting the parry on me a little bit. So Castle is really good at doing this. Got a guy that I've been playing with a little bit off uh, when I play offline. He is honestly the... Hmm, I can't punish that with that. What can I punish that with? Okay, a little late on that crosscut. He uses V-Trigger too, especially when we play, he plays Ryu Mirrors with me. He will use V-Trigger 2. He will use that forward heavy punch and then immediately go into that V-Trigger 2 because it's got the parry frames on it and stuff, right? But yeah. Hey Cap, how are we today, my friend? Hope you're having a lovely Sunday. Huh? Oh, that was meant to be a DP and he screwed it up. Pressure. Watching Cap. Hmm, okay. I'm getting... Oh god, I don't have... That's his freaking EX. I mean, V-Trigger. Hmm, unfortunate on that. No DP. Okay. Oh, dude, I thought it was like a, what do you call it? Um, fireball coming, and I don't know what the hell just happened there, but that was unfortunate for him. All right, that's minus six, so that reaches from there. You know what I need to do after this? Cap, if you could remind me, could you remind me to move my chat over slightly? Because I can't actually read some of that. It's uh, cut off on the shitty screen that I'm using for my second screen. Like, legit, I'm so budget. I, uh, I'm using, like, an old TV. I think it's, like, a camping TV for, um... My second monitor. Of course, I don't have the like luxury of buying that shit. Monitors are expensive, guys. Oh, I tried to do a crosscut. Unfortunate on that freaking drop there, bud. I probably could have punished that too. Oh, this time the me there too. Okay, I screwed that up too on the meaty. I don't know if I can make this back or not. I know I can't. <laughs> Read it in match, okay? Oh, dude! See, people are really aggressive, and I tried to do that, and I fucked up on that buffer there. People are really aggressive with Ryu, and I just don't know how to be, which is the problem. And that was meant to be a forward punch, I guess. Oh, I don't have the X meter. I'm looking at his meter again. Hmm, maybe I'm used to it being on player one side. Oh, yes! Oh my god, the comeback! Oh yeah! Sorry, I know that wasn't that impressive, but for me, that was impressive. Ah! God. Jump. Nope, oh god, I'm look not looking at the freaking ground again. Oh no, DP. That was meant to be a DP and it came out as a freaking Hadouken because I don't think I hit forward. Oh dude, nice, nice, nice. That's that bad habit I have again. Ooh. Okay. Whoa, what happened there? I thought I was blocking, but apparently I wasn't. Can I jump again? Oh, 
Oh, dude, I totally could have DP'd there. I punched that then. What's he doing? Dude, I need to... Good shit. I need to not throw out moves willy-nilly. I need to actually try and space them as well. Because that medium kick was not going to hit at all. And I should have realized that instead of going on autopilot. God damn, I nearly jumped into that. I was trying to air-to-air -air him. And I effed up the input. And I walked into that. Everyone finishes with her doke, and I don't know why I'm trying not to. Ooh, nice. Ooh. Dude, this guy's got my number. That was not a proper cross cut. That was not a proper meaty. Nice. Oh, dude. That caught me off guard. I'm not gonna lie. I thought he was doing the target combo. I was like, maybe I can sneak in something there, even though I've never tried to do that before. I don't know why I thought I could do it this time. Okay. Oh! That's sick. What does that do? Oh, God. I panicked. Good shit, man. Thank you so much for the match. I think that's something that I need to start doing. Is start looking at what other Ryu's are doing and see how I can implement that into my game as opposed to just looking at my own mistakes. Looking at what other people are doing that are working and see how I can adapt that to my own game.